Hi there. Today I'm going to show you how to survey ground control points or GCPs using MLIT uh, Rich RS2 or RS3. I have here a ground control point, a bipod and uh, MLIT Rich RS3 and um, it's all leveled and on the point. So let's get to the application. Go to the app. And I'm going to wait to connect. A few moments later. So I can see my receiver. I would just, it just got connected. Uh, we go to survey and there is a test. You need to go to plus. You need to wait for a fixed solution. Right, so the IMU is not activated, but it's not a problem because I am on a bipod. If you are surveying, you need to have your IMU activating just by walking back and forth. So you need to choose your point name and that will be GCP01, station description, whatever you want for me, station. You can see here the tolerances, you can see the pole height, which is two meters, it's a fixed pole. And you can see the coordinate in a local grid, which is OHGB, because I live in Scotland. And here you can see, you can set your pole height under the aerial, and then it will calculate automatic up to the receiver, to the center. So we exit this, we go to settings that we button on the left hand side. And if you survey just one off point, you press the timer off. Or if you measure a ground control point like we do now, you set your timer to three or five minutes. I will set it just for three minutes. And press save. And we need to move the receiver. So apparently it doesn't let you survey if you don't have the IMU activated. So I just took a walk and just set back on point as you can see. And now we're going to survey. Now you can see everything is green, is fixed. The IMU is activated. You can select a code, uh, which is going to be a point. And uh, as, you say, as you can see here, it's three minutes is uh the precision is really good and press measure you can press accept anytime if you feel it is enough but i will leave it for three minutes and now our three minutes are gone and uh it's save automatic and now it just goes to the next point as you see gcp02 you can export your points by going to projects and then you go to the three dots, export and whatever is convenient, CSV, if you're using as a ground control points. So if you like this tutorial, uh, please press subscribe and I will see you on the next one.